people and Shannon Martin is getting a jump start <laughs> on the party live right now. It's celebrating an anniversary this year. That's right, Neil. 20 years they are celebrating this year. Right now, I can tell you, everywhere I look, I can see food. And that's what we spent the day doing today, sampling just about any kind of Greek food you can imagine, from heroes to flaming cheese. That's where they basically take some cheese, throw some vodka on it, yellopa, and you eat it. Delicious. And also, I think this is my favorite. These are honey balls. So basically, you've got dough soaked in honey. Amazingly delicious. I can't wait to go to town on that. So this all started with food, right? Well, restaurant owners wanting to draw people to the area. 5,000 people that first year. This year, more than 1.3 million expected here this weekend. So what does it take to get ready for Taste of the Danforth? Here's John from Papa's Grill explaining how much grocery shopping he had to do. Uh, 1,200 pounds of lamb. We did about uh, 800 pounds of pork. We did about, uh, about another 1,200 pounds of chicken. Uh, never mind, uh, you know, 16 boxes of romaine lettuce so far, and I might have to make a run on Sunday. So, uh, yeah, it's, it's, it's definitely a different ordering for this week. 1,200 pounds of lamb and chicken, and he thinks he's going to have to get more. That shows you how much food they really need here. We know it is 20 years, and they're celebrating by trying to break a couple of world records. One, the largest container ever of Greek yogurt, 1,500 pounds. They're going to try and break that tomorrow. Coming up at 6 o'clock, I'll tell you about the other record. They're trying to break more food, more fun. That's coming up at 6. All right, thank you, Shannon. They're going to eat all of it. You'll see. <laughs>